Welcome, in front of me is Acer Nitro 5 and in this video I will show you how to make your laptop faster. The first thing that you can do is change the power mode by right clicking the battery icon on the status bar and going to power and sleep settings. Here you can select the power mode, then change the balance mode to best performance. I recommend only doing this for your device when it's plugged in because when it's on battery it should be either in balanced or in or in best power efficiency mode uh, otherwise the, the battery will discharge very quick. The next thing that you can do is disable startup apps. To do that right click the taskbar, click task manager, then go to startup apps. Uh, sort them by status and check which applications have uh, the enabled status. These applications will uh, start running with when your device starts up. Now, as you can see, for me, uh, these applications are basically essentials. But if you have some uh, applications that you don't necessarily need to start up, uh, then you'll have to, in order to disable them, right click oh, such application and select disable. And this way you will prevent the application from startup uh, with your PC. The next thing that you can do is keep your device up to date. To do that, open the start menu, then go to settings, then go to Windows update, click check for updates and wait until uh, Windows finds any updates for you. And uh, once it does, it will automatically start to download and install them. Additionally, you can go to advanced options, go to optional updates and if you have any updates here, especially the driver updates, then of course download and install them too by hitting the checkbox next to each uh, update and uh, clicking download and install afterwards. The next thing that you can do is uh, update uh, your device's drivers and optimize its work using uh, NitroSense and Acer's Control Center applications. To do that, you have to open the web browser, then open a search engine and search for the Acer drivers. Find the official acer.com slash home slash support website that says download Acer support drivers and manuals. Enter either your serial number or SNID right here. You can find these numbers uh, by looking at the back cover of your device as it shows right here. You should find uh, a label with uh, these two numbers. Just uh, enter one of these, uh, just uh, write one of them down or take a photo of them and uh, then write them into this field. So let me do that with you. Once you enter this number, press enter. And then scroll all the way down the list to find application section. Here you'll uh, find the Acer Care Center and uh, NitroSense applications. Download both of them. Wait until they are downloaded. You can open your downloads folder and wait until they are downloaded. And once they are, open both of these files, copy the folder inside and paste it into this folder. Next, open the fol uh, folders and click setup in each of them. And after you click setup, you have to press next and accept the user agreement to continue. Of course, read it before you do it. And then click next a couple more times and uh, the application will be installed. I'm not gonna do this because I already have these applications on my device. I just want to show you how to do it. So, 
run the setup files in uh, both folders and in a while you'll be able to find this application applications in start menu all applications list and here you have the care center and uh, nitro sense now in the care center if you open it you'll be able to do actually a lot of things uh, first of all you can update drivers by clicking update tab and uh, here in this update center you can uh, click check now and see if uh, the application has any required updates for your device and if it says that your system is up to date and you don't need to update in, uh, in any way and uh, that's actually great but if you do have any updates uh, then you can click update all and uh, update your device to the left latest version of the software now you can also go to the checkup and check your device's hardware if, and check if it's in good condition and in tune up sec section you can uh, click optimize and uh, impact uh, the boot time of your device uh, this way you can delete uh, junk files by going to this tab and selecting clean and ok then uh, you can also ok basically nothing here <laughs> is uh, is important in in, uh, in the topic of this video and uh, as for the NitroSense application once you open it, you'll be able to enable, uh, for example, cool boost uh, feature by switching the toggle to the right. And if cool boost feature is on, it increases the maximum fan speed, uh, which enables uh, uh, faster fan speeds during heavy use, which is also very important in your case. Uh, you can also control your uh, fans by changing from uh, them uh, to max or custom speed you can also change uh, the power plant here and it's uh, pretty similar but I, I think it uh, affects more hardware on your PC uh, if you change it right here uh, so for example you can go with high performance mode and it surely works better than uh, Windows high performance mode so it's uh, so if you want uh, to get the best performance out of your device of go with high performance in here and uh, I think that that's basically it uh, all I wanted to mention in this video so uh, thank you for watching it if you liked it consider subscribing to our channel uh, leave us a like in the comment below and I'll see you in the next one